Hello my friends and welcome back. I'm going to mix things up a little bit this week because mama's in need of some yarn. in need of some yarn. We're gonna go on a little road trip, pick up some supplies, dabble in a little vlogging, I guess. Sir, those aren't even real meows, sir. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so we're gonna go venture off to Hirschner's. I'm gonna go venture off to Hirschner's and pick up a couple supplies. We'll still make a little something so we can scratch that. I made things out of strings itch that I'm sure we all have. So let's go do the thing. Ooh, there she at. I only need purple and off-white yarn, but we're gonna see what happens. But first, because they ask that you wear masks and I'm not a dick, Let's do this. Let's go see if the warehouse is having a sale. Oh, wait, what's this? Okay, it's pretty. Do I have that? I do now. It's really weird. The first time I've done this, so we're gonna go check to see if they do a warehouse sale. I had a conversation with somebody that I should have had in the shopping cart, but I didn't because I'm too stubborn. best friends with a lady from Ohio who ended up with three bags of yarn. I only ended up with one, so I will call that a success. I'm gonna go get the rest of my groceries, we'll go home, and then we'll go through our goodies. Let's do it. I just got the one. I went in just for purple and off-white yarn, and I came out with purple. Uh, I've mentioned it in past videos, but Worsted 8 is my favorite. So, more Worsted 8 friends. Worsted 8 Baby, which, frankly, it's the exact same makeup. It's the same amount, just the colors are a little, a little different. A little lighter, I guess, it's more babyish. I guess. This one is Splash. Red Merlot-ish color. This is Mahogany. Off-white. 
This one's Aaron. Aaron. Uh, Aaron. And a certain grump we know. This one is Orchid. A little different than the lavender chestnut. This one is Tiger Lily. They also had a bunch of Bernat Super Value in the warehouse on sale. This one in grass. Grass! This one is Dark Mauve. And then there's Mauve. And then we have Taupe. And that was all that's in this bag. This is all I got from Hershey. But I did do grocery pickup from Walmart and ended up getting a couple of big haunted skeins of black yarn because I'm always running out of black yarn. We have two large boys. Cool. So that was my yarn haul. Seeing all the colors together, I'm already getting tons of ideas and even going through the warehouse, I was getting tons of just inspiration and ideas on what I wanted to make. I will take a couple of these and we'll figure out something to whip up, some kind of fun little amigurumi. Maybe I'll cop out and make an African flower animal. We'll see. I have no room to work on my desk right now. I gotta clear this off. What's this? A call to action in my good American YouTube video. Well, I never. And if you also never, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Click the like button to mess with the algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section. And then follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Or go ahead and check out my Etsy and Ravelry shops to see which patterns are available for purchase or if I have any ready-made items ready to ship out to you. And now back to our regularly scheduled programming. I'll start out with this Burnett Super Saver in grass. Grass! along with this tan skein from my stash, some orange from today's trip, and another skein from my stash in pink. I'll be using my E or 3.5 millimeter crochet hook, some scissors, a yarn needle, and stuffing. And now let me just scooch this out of the way. For today's project, I'm going to make a stack of ice cream scoops. Actually, a stack of sherbet scoops. But the little scoops of sherbet are going to look like tiny little octopuses. Octopi. They're going to look like tiny little octopi. Octa sherbet. Octa sherbet. The colors are based on the rainbow sherbet flavor, which was a combination of raspberry, lime, and orange or tangerine flavored sherbet. I remember having this as a treat a lot as a kid. If you also enjoy rainbow sherbet, go ahead and leave a comment below. Now that our orange scoop is done, we need to roll up our sleeves and make a lime scoop. Perfect. Next up, excuse you, our raspberry scoop. You know what every sherbet scoop needs? Lips. Just scooch this back here. Now for the cone. You just root around in here. All right. Since I can't find a center pole, we're gonna have to remove the wrapper. Let me just fish my crochet hook back out of here and get a start on our cone. We're just going to do a flat bottom cake cone instead of a pointed cone. It'll just be easier to display with a flat bottom. Good night, everybody. Oops, let me just rip this section out, recount it, and redo it. Yeah. 
And now that our cone is done, we can go ahead and assemble everything off camera. Oh, I gave them faces too. And despite having their flat bottom, they're still a little top heavy. But that's okay. We have a sherbet octopus. I like how they turned out. I like all the colors. Now, do you say sherbet or sherbert? I always grew up saying sherbert, but it is in fact spelled sherbet. Thanks, English language. Hi. Thank you, my friends, for coming along with me on this little adventure. If you want to see me venture out to other yarn stores or other craft stores, leave me a comment below with your suggestions. And with that, I thank you all very much for watching. I appreciate the crap out of you, my friends. Okay, I love you, bye! Look at all of this. What even is all this? Oh, you purr so loud. You stink. You smell like old man cat. Oh, I'm gonna be itchy. Oh, no. I'm gonna get out of there. Oh, are there critters back there? That would be spooky. Are you seeing a kid out here? Oh god, okay, it's a statue. Our neighbors just put this little farm boy statue on the side of their house, and I thought it was one of their grandkids just staring at our house. Mama, get out of there! You know, you can go running when it's time to eat, but then when it's time to go up the stairs when you get yelled at, then you just act like you're the weakest thing. Anyway. <laughs>